Hey, hey, welcome back guys. I am super excited to have you here today. If you remember a couple months ago, this place was in complete shambles, right? Well, not complete shambles, we were just putting a lot of work and love into it. But I am so happy that now, two months back in the future, we've got saunas, we've got a pool that's running, we've got waterfalls and all kinds of cool stuff to make this short-term rental, this boutique hotel, different from the rest. So I wanna show you guys all the work that we did and I wanna show you how cool it looks. So come and check it out with me, all right? We just installed these stairs too, so please watch your stuff coming up. Brand new stairs, brand new cement. We did full landscaping in this place, but I wanna show you this room right here. You remember last time this room, the shower wasn't done, there was no furnishings at all, but I'm gonna show you how much that has changed. Check this out, right? Huge, huge first unit. This is our wonderful Serenity unit. It's got a fully furnished bed. You got a fully done kitchen here, right? Again, new appliances. You got a big refrigerator, a great place to cook. You got an oven to bake your cookies when you're coming up here and staying in the hills. We got custom art done by local artists, which is a really big, important part of my business. Come on here in the bathroom, I'll show you guys this. Look at this shower. You can't even touch the ceiling. I love this shower. It's gonna be so cool. People are gonna enjoy it. And uh, I think people are gonna spend a lot of time in here, honestly. Watch your step again. <laughs> but um, all the furnishings are done. We had a wonderful team come in here and put together the whole place. I love the way it came out. We really wanted to pull in some stuff from the outside and make it feel like part of the outside is part of the inside of this place, right? You can sit here on the couch right at the end of your bed. Enjoy some TV, your favorite Netflix. Uh, well, my show's not on right now, so. But uh, yeah, it's, you got your closet space here. You can put your clothes when you, when you check in, put all your stuff here, make sure it's organized if you want to iron. You got your ironing board here with your iron, some towels for your bath. And the coolest thing is you got your own selection of pool towels because there is a kick-ass pool here and I'm gonna show you guys that later. But all this is part of the experience that you get when you stay here at the Amador Boutique Hotel. You got a wonderful place to have your breakfast, your coffee, right? Looking out the window, at the passing deer. Maybe you wanna check out your car, make sure it's still there. <laughs> but um, yeah, just a really comfortable place to be. And um, come on, I wanna show you the next room right next door. This is the next door suite. This is called the Enchante Suite. And let me tell you why it's Enchante, whatever that word means, right? So you got your TV right here below the couch and you got your massive comfortable bed here, which I cannot wait for you to try out because I handpicked these mattresses with my team. They're super firm, but also super comfortable. Custom art, right? And then check this out, a built-in fireplace. I think the last time we were here, the guys were working on it. There was wires everywhere, but we have a working custom built-in fireplace. And that is right next to this massive, massive, let me get in here and show you guys. This massive walk-in sauna. Again, you can't touch the ceiling, watch. See, you can't touch the ceiling and I think, yeah. I think you could probably fit maybe four people in there, you know, but I don't know, I haven't tried. People, you guys will let me know when you stay here. You got your bathroom off to the side and then you got this really cool open concept kitchen right behind the door here. You got this really big refrigerator. So if you wanna have a lot of snacks and treats when you're here, you got plenty of storage and place to keep it. Freezer, open concept kitchen, right? You got your coffee, toaster, microwave. You got your stove here, you bake your cookies, all in this one suite, right? We designed it, we really want it to be comfortable for people. We wanted people to be able to come here and do everything they could do at home here while they're staying in Amador. You got your couch, just like the other unit next door. Big, comfortable leather couch. Uh, people are really gonna enjoy this place. All right, well, I'm gonna show you guys the third unit upstairs, the Grand Royale Suite. That was unit two. I'm gonna show you the third unit. And then after that, I'm gonna show you the super exciting hot tub outdoor experience. So come on, can't wait to show you guys. You'll notice that this entire property, all the landscaping has been done. We spent weeks redoing all the landscaping and it's super cool and super clean. So right up the stairs, we're gonna head to the Grand Residence, the Grand Royale Suite. 
Come on, guys. Okay, you'll notice too, the entire exterior of the place was completely power washed. So we got rid of all those cobwebs, all the spires and dirt washed away and ready for the first guest to come. So, let's go inside. Oh, was that loud? <laughs> okay, let's go inside. All right, and welcome to the grand residence. So, big difference from last time you we were here, right? The fireplace is finished. We got all the furnishings, the art hung in the place. We got a fresh coat of paint on the doors and on the trimming. And then my favorite, if you didn't know, I'm also an artist. So I did a custom piece for this place, which is awesome. And it's also for sale. And um, stepping on here, this is the living room or dining room area. You got a big, huge dining table here, right? It is set for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people. Eight people can sit here and have an awesome meal together and really have a place to build a great experience, right? And that's what it's all about. Making cool places for people to have a really cool experience. Oh, check this out over here. In this nook, we put in a bar, right? So you got some wine, you got some glasses, you can actually make a drink for yourself here and sit down and have some dinner. How cool is that, right? Right around the corner here, I'm gonna show you guys our big, massive, awesome kitchen. Ta-da! Yeah! If you remember, we used to, of course you saw the appliances last time, but you didn't see all the furnishings that we put in here. All the touches that really make this place unique and memorable. These are really important because people are gonna see this and think, wow, this is really organized, really cool. They put a lot of thought into this place, right? Big, huge, massive refrigerator. So obviously if you wanna have an event here, there's enough food space and storage to be able to do that. You got your microwave, you got your wine glasses, the kitchen sinks into your dishes. Basically, you can cook for a huge family in this space and that's what we really wanted to do with the furnishings. So right off the kitchen, we got this cool bathroom. I wanna show you guys this right next to the front door. By the way, this is really cool too. I thought these were really nice touches. These are coat hangers, right? So when you arrive, you can hang your coat up. You can sit down on this bench, take off your muddy shoes if they're muddy and uh, slide. <laughs> sit down on this bench. <laughs> Okay. That's funny, I just say sit down this <laughs> You can sit down on this bench, right? Take your shoes off and slide them under here and then you can have, you know, you can walk around with the shoes off. And then right over here is a bathroom. Check out this bathroom, right? Floor to ceiling curtains, which really makes the, like, the bathroom look like really dramatic, right? It gives it a nice soft feel. All the curtains are light or white colored. That way you're not blocking out the light. It makes a smaller room just seem larger. But look at this color. I love this color. It immediately pops your attention and uh, it's something different, right? When else have you seen an orange and gold bathroom? I haven't. All right, so I'm gonna head upstairs. I'm gonna show you guys some more cool art and some more rooms. Check this out. This huge mirror that we put here, I really wanted a dramatic kind of, hello, how are you doing? Uh, effect as soon as you get up the stairs. So we put this massive mirror. Actually, I repainted this myself and I made it look really old by putting some etch marks, but big pieces like this just make the place, the place look really different and cool. All right, right off to the stairs, you got this little mini room here. Got your nice bunk beds with soft white linens, right? The white really makes the place look really clean. People appreciate that. Your guests really appreciate stuff that really looks clean. Always use white when you can. Got this really cool wallpaper that we installed. And again, window treatments that are white, let the light in, make it look really nice, clean, fresh, right? Around the corner here, I'm gonna show you guys this other bathroom. Now check out this bathroom. Look at that shower. I love the tile in there. That tile is all hand installed. It's really cool, all modern, updated, new tile. We got a huge, ornate mirror right over the bathroom sink and uh, some really nice tile too. Storage area here right outside the bathroom. And then check out this room. Four bunk beds, right? Now I'm gonna try and get up here. You got a cool bunk bed. Again, really comfortable mattress, right? A nice place to sleep, hang out with your friends, right? Watch a movie or two and just enjoy the quiet kind of environment that you're in out here in Amador. If you really want to enjoy the nature, you can go right outside to the patio. I'm gonna show you guys that right now. Come out here and check out this view, right? Close the door, make sure we're not letting any bugs in. So yeah, you come out here, chill with your coffee and just enjoy the outdoors, right? You're creating spots for people to have cool memories in. That's what it's all about. 
So let me show you guys the rest of the house. Come on. Oh my god, are you serious? Did you just lock what? us out? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> I think the door is locked. We're on this patio. I know, dude, and we can't, and I, I, I cannot can't jump down. That. Can you like climb the roof and like go around the other patio? Can't hear me right now, Michael, but I am charging you double for this video because parkour is not in the damn job description. Here we go. Check out this though. Huh? 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 Yeah, he wanted me to jump down that. Oh, fuck. We don't get paid enough to do this. Bruh. Bruh. <laughs> Alright, so we're back. <laughs> Sorry about that. So. Let's keep on and showing you the rest of the, the rest of the place. Come down the hallway. All right, remember this room? It was in shambles, there was nothing in here, but check this out, right? Look at this art. This is our artist, Liliana Rodriguez. Actually, check this out. Hi, I'm Liliana, and, uh, AKA LR Creations. So I do art uh, branding for uh, any businesses. This is one of my pieces that I made. Uh, it's called La Pistampienza. I love to do Italian titles because it sounds more fancier. It's called wisdom in English. All right, Liliana, we love this place, but dang it, now the animals are inside, so we got to get the animals out and get out of here. All right, now we have another animal inspired um, to deers. They symbolize intuition, so that's what I called it. So here we are with little abstract deers and bring more color and life to this place. There you go, bringing more animals inside. Come on, we got to get these animals out of here. Yeah, so the first time I got this canvas, I didn't know what I was going to do, it was what I was going to paint. Uh, I was thinking about the Amador City gold mine and so I had is this, this a texture bird or a mountain medium or a sky what is this bird thing I don't know Michael it's actually both it's a mountain and an eagle and it's called freedom oh okay I get it Liliana thanks you so much for explaining uh, unfortunately we're at animal capacity for Amador Springs so I'm gonna have to ask you and the animals to get out right now because we don't have any more room for the animals so thank you so much for coming and appreciate it hey guys though in all seriousness if you love Liliana's art as much as we do check out her stuff online she's super good and all of her artwork is for sale which is so cool and part of again what makes Art House different check it out all right I really want to show you guys this bathroom come check it out I think the last time you guys were here there was no no furnishings it wasn't complete we had wires everywhere but you got this really cool bathtub right and look at these sheer white curtains right that just allow the landscape to kind of poke through imagine being in here with a glass of wine right you and your partner and you guys are just enjoying the quiet and relaxing and checking out the landscape right this is what it's about this is what we really try to create here solo furnishings in this place you got a really cool tall shower here with a detachable uh, shower head <laughs> and then over here you got my favorite right the bunk beds cool thing about these bunk beds is they are queen size right so an adult can fit in them easily got a matching bunk bed down here again really nice clean fresh furnishings people your guests are really going to appreciate that king size bed and over here right off of the bed you got your own private patio check this out how cool is this? Take a look at what Amador has to offer. You got a brewery right down the driveway. You got a restaurant, another hotel. This, this is really what it's all about. Coming up here, relaxing, and again, making a unique experience for folks. Sit out here, have your coffee, have your breakfast, and then you go take a shower. <laughs> right, so this is what it's about. This is the third suite in the Amador Boutique Hotel and uh, it's been a lot of work you guys remember like like i said the last time you were here everything was kind of all over the place we put a lot of blood and sweat and tears even in the last two months and made this place into what you've just seen now let's go check out the outside because that's what i'm most most excited about we put a ton more work out there so come on let's check it out come down here through the kitchen and this is what i've been really excited to show you guys about is this outdoor space right check this out listen to this Ta-da! I mean, look at this space. It's a freaking waterfall, right? 
This is so dope. We actually, this whole space was overgrown with weeds, bushes. We came in, fully landscaped it. We repiped the waterfall and we got this awesome, really cool feature here. And uh, there's no fish in it, but for now, it's just a really cool spot. You take pictures out here, come and hang out. Just enjoy the quiet ambiance of a, your own private waterfall. How cool is that, right? Then right here, brand new built pizza oven. Yes, this is a brick pizza oven that we fully installed brick by brick, right? So you light your fire down here, you can put your pizza in here, and you got your chimney where the smoke comes up, but all of this was just installed brick by brick. I mean, how cool is this, right? You come out here, have pizza, sit down, eat the pizza, hang out with your friends, and just enjoy nature, right? You come over here, I want, to check, I want you to check out the pool area. All right, now you got some tables here. You can sit down, have your breakfast out here, talk with your friends, have some lunch, and then, Go for a dip in the pool. <laughs> yeah. Psych. <No. laughs> but you get the idea, right? You got your own private pool. And right up here, guess what that is? That is a sauna. Come on, I'm gonna check, check, show you guys, I'm gonna check it out. Watch your step on these stairs. Another cool fountain feature here, right? It goes all the way up the hill. We literally carved the dirt out of the side of this hill and installed this waterfall, right? You come right this way, a freshly built sauna, right? Right up the stairs. All right, I gotta show you, this is the coolest thing right here. A freaking outdoor shower, dude. This is so cool, right? Come out here, you can select the temperature you want. You can also, you can also use the wand, right? So how cool is this, right? You can be outside naked and take a shower, right? And just enjoy, be really connected with nature. That's, that's what you really want, want us to do for people. Give them the chance to be really connected with nature. And now inside your sauna, this is, look at this, right? You can have a seat, ah, just be here, one with nature. Uh, this is really cool too here. You got a rock salt feature with lights. That's cool, all right? Could you imagine being here at night and doing your strobe light purple? You got a purple experience, right? Guests are gonna love it. We thought it was really cool. And uh, a lot of people are gonna spend a lot of cool time in this space right here. All right, so as if the sauna wasn't cool enough, I'm gonna show you the best, coolest hot tub you've ever seen. Come on. No, not, not this one, not this one. This one, this one up here. All right, this is the coolest hot tub you've ever seen, AKA cold plunge, right? Now I know what you're thinking, you're thinking cold, why would anybody want to be cold? But actually, it is a very refreshing experience. One to two minutes inside this cold plunge will really wake you up and make you feel super fresh and awake. It is crystal clear water, chilled to 47 degrees Fahrenheit and it will just make you feel alive, right? Guests are gonna love this. Sit here, you know, take your shoes off, your pants off, your shirts off, and then dive right on in. But the cold plunge, people are gonna love it, and where else are you gonna find this kind of experience, right? Think outside the box when you're furnishing. We think this is gonna be one of the coolest things that people love to enjoy out here in Amador Springs. Oh yeah, and we have this hot tub right there. So that's Amador City, guys. That's what we've been working on for the last two months. You guys have seen them before when everything was all over the place and there was nothing outside. Now you've seen everything that we put inside and outside of the place. And uh, I am super excited for this place to be open and for people to come here and enjoy it because that's what it's all about, right? We built this place for people to enjoy, to come out here and make unique experiences. And I'm so glad I got to show you guys it and I hope that you guys like what you saw and we're on to the next project. Hey guys, this is Michael. If you like this video, subscribe because it really helps me make more content like this just for you. And if you love this video, check out this one right here.